Do words like heat death, big crunch, or the big rip sound scary to you? Well, they should. These are some of the theories that explain how the universe is going to die. However, in my opinion, there are two words that are actually a lot scarier. Vacuum decay. Now, I know it doesn't sound that scary at first, but it's the most unpredictable way for the universe to die. Before we start talking about it, though, let's talk about vacuum states. There are many quantum fields in our universe. When these fields are at their lowest point of energy, they are in their vacuum state. The universe is described as stable if all of these quantum fields are in their vacuum state. Most of these fields are in their vacuum states and are stable. However, there may be one that isn't yet. The Higgs field could possibly be metastable. This means that the field looks like it's stable, but it really isn't. To truly understand what this means, let's imagine that we have a ball next to a hill. You can see that the ball is stationary since it is in this valley, so it seems stable. However, because it isn't at its lowest possible point, which is the point of stability, it isn't stable. This hill right here is acting like a barrier and isn't allowing the ball to get to its lowest point. So the ball is metastable. It's faking its stability. Because the Higgs field is in a metastable state, the universe is also in a state of metastability or in a false vacuum. On the other hand, a true vacuum is stable. Let's take a look at this graph. Looks familiar, doesn't it? The ball in the scenario I just described to you can be represented by the Higgs field. Currently, the Higgs field is in a false vacuum or state of metastability. The Y axis shows the energy level. So it makes sense for the true vacuum to be at the lowest point of energy, which is right here. Now the scary part about this whole theory is that the Higgs field could jump over this barrier and into the true vacuum. If this happens, a bubble of true vacuum would form at some point in the universe and start to expand. It would move at the speed of light and engulf the whole universe. Anything the bubble touches would be obliterated. It would essentially erase life, chemistry, and even physics as we know it. However, it would take an astronomical amount of energy for the Higgs field to get around this barrier. Unfortunately, there's another way for the Higgs field to descend towards a true vacuum. Quantum tunneling is when a particle passes through a barrier, even though it physically shouldn't really be able to. For the Higgs field, it looks something like this. The quantum tunneling of the Higgs field will cause the unpredictable depth of the universe. But don't be scared. Vacuum decay is still a theory, so it hasn't even been 100% proven yet. And also, if a true vacuum bubble does form far away enough, then it would take millions of years to reach our planet. Thanks for watching.